Welcome back, explorers. Okay, so today we are getting a private tour of DHX Media. If you didn't know, this is where the set of Degrassi is, a television show filmed right here in Toronto. Happens to be one of John's favorite shows. He's watched it half your life. Yeah, more than half his life. More than half his life. One of his favorite shows. I personally never seen it, but I'm still excited to be on the set of an actual television show. This is pretty sweet. You can actually see the school buses and stuff from the set from the front. So, come along with us for a tour. Shut up and sit down. Linda and I had a really nice dinner um, with all of them who were graduating. Just uh, Linda and I, and then just sitting down, and then and we showed them because the cast doesn't see uh, what they shot for quite a long while. All right. So, but we uh, pulled some. See, even if it was just in rough cuts, some of the some of their best scenes from the season. So we had a nice dinner uh, at our place, and then uh, showed them some of it, and then we sort of all sat around and we sang songs and we group hugged. Yeah, no, that, that has to be really tough because, I mean, you're with them all the time, I'm guessing, so you get to... Yeah, well, Linda and I and <clears throat> Stephanie um, aren't on set all the time, although Stephanie might be this year on set more, but, um, so we've, we've got television feeds, so it's really up to the director, who a lot of the time is Seth and Brogan. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got uh, a few other directors who use, but he's there a lot of them. So when we drop by, it's usually because they're just going around and saying, you're doing a great job. <laughs> and and uh, so we don't see them a ton, uh, but we love it when we yeah. And we come after four or five years, we can sort of see them and run into them and they shoot right here, right there. Yeah. Right there. Yeah. 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 It's one of the joys of being here. Now, unfortunately, today, it's like a cavern, right? Yeah, uh, exactly. and a lot of the sets are wrapped up, and we'll have uh, you know plastic all over them. Mm -hmm. But you'll get a sense that we do everything there: the writing, the editing, the, the everything is done in house. So we're always running into mm -hmm. the cast, the editors, the writers. It makes it all very efficient. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to lie; I'm mean, <laughs> definitely disappointed with the way you guys have went musically with that. Oh, it's, it's not your favorite. I don't really like the new one. I don't like the way it's done now because I'm used to the old way. Well, well, I mean, I, I used to sing along with it. Yeah, yeah well, the favorite was when we had that long yeah. intro, yeah. which we had to shorten at a certain point. Yeah, no, I mean, and, that's fine. Uh, but, and, but it was sort of told a story from the beginning yeah. to the yeah, end. Yeah, no, I, I always loved uh, well, watching wrote it. He's yeah. one of the writers on the I, show. I so. actually did not know that. Yeah. that no, was I was awesome. watching those credits very carefully. <laughs> <laughs> okay, a pleasure. Oh, thank, you. Oh, yeah. thank you. It's That's nice okay. meeting you. Perfect. Thanks for being fan. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, thank you. Mike's being cool. We always talk about Detroit. So this is where it means nothing to you right now because it's gross and ugly right now. Um, but this is where they all audition and this is where all those read-throughs happen. This is where all of that happens? Yeah, the read-throughs and the auditions, yeah. You've kind of seen the stuff online of them in their circle read-throughs? Yes, I yeah. have. I've seen That's here, yeah. So cool. Yeah. It's so neat. Is this plaque made specifically for this or is it just a plaque you guys I think they just got it as a generic plaque. I feel like they're. Sometimes the names on the face are like the crew, but it won't be anything to like Yeah, that's what I was going to ask. Names will be on it or like our names are on it. No, that's, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I figure there's, there's a, a lot board, of Easter eggs there's a in here. Board that, where you can actually read the names where they did have like people that we know, but this I think they just left it from a. Yeah. yeah because no one's going to be able to read any of this at all. The driver education course. Uh, the scars on the wall. 
Yeah. And now I'm going to always notice that these are popped off if these are ever in shot or yeah, so I'm missing a few things. Yeah, and I don't know what this is about. Like, you would never still have this in the school. <laughs> Especially if you're always with that modern and you're yeah. flat screens, you would never have this. Maybe it's just an antique. Yeah, yeah maybe maybe Simpson just loves it. I mean, that, does. that has to be it. That yeah. definitely. Awesome office. Oh, this is actually moving. Yeah, so we've used it as a locker room before. This is actually remnants of the here. This is. These dorm rooms here are not. They are, um... Um, yeah, this is for makeup pop, so it's kind of nothing now. Uh, because that would always be the thing you do about from the back of the But, um, yeah, so this is all up. Okay, story. Yeah, I find it interesting that they are, uh, so close. Yeah. These are just like random walls. Yeah, these are random flats for back to the and whatnot. So like, you just pull them out and arrange them how yeah. you need them yeah, and then right. shoot. If we need a bathroom for one episode, one little scene with the girl in the bathroom, they'll literally pop up four of these walls and build a bathroom in a day. <laughs> so they, they lay down the tub, they lay down, well, I'll show you one here, there's one here. And so they could do a pop-up version of that. So this is Studio C. So this is where we've done like airport terminals, shopping malls, movie okay. theaters, because look how big this space is. Yeah. yeah. We can build anything here. Or we can just do little tiny squares. Pop-up pop washrooms, bedrooms. Did you like LA I Complex? I loved that show. That was LA Complex. I did not, I see it, yes, yes. I I was disappointed it got yeah. canceled. I'm like, when's the new season coming on? I know. Google it and, and you saw gone. Manny in it? Yeah, yeah. no, yeah. exactly, yeah, Cass, that, that's why I started watching. Yeah. And uh, I was, I, I, I'm not kidding, I was really, really disappointed. I was, we were too, we were where we wanted it to go. It was actually, you know, a great, interesting take on LA. Yeah, no, I, I, I loved it. Also, yeah. that's where it was going. Yeah, I remember it was doing the Dianetics and everything. It was making fun yes. of like the whole scene in LA. Yes. And so we were really taking a risk with that storyline of, you know, talking about how crazy it is. And so yeah, they converted this to Hollingsworth Mansion when that show finished. I, I did not know that. That is... Yeah. 
they're really like they have invested in this pool and this infrastructure, so like, we gotta do something with it. We can't just let it sit there. Yeah. So, bring in the rich kids. Yeah. It's crazy how flawed things are that you don't notice. Yeah. Like little dents in the candles or the floor being like yeah. you just you don't see these things on film. Yeah, like it's the, been lived in. Yeah. They have pictures that the kids send in of their own families. That is so cool. Yeah, yeah Jocelyn has to take off to do some work. Oh, oh, I'm sure nice, like, meeting nice meeting you. Well. Yeah, no, yeah, nice thank you. Thank, thank you, you for well. walking around with us. Yeah. And then this is um so this is just a little study area. Yeah. And then we go in, bye guys. Bye. And this is the gym. Yeah, this is, this is the best part of like walking through things. I'm like, oh, we're really right next to each other. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's, it's yeah, it's, it's totally, just you can walk in from one side to the other. Yeah. The floors are painted, but they look like wood. Yeah. Yeah. It's <laughs> <That's> awesome. <laughs> it's so cool. Yeah, my flash. I see. Oh. Uh, I was actually going to ask. The I Arabic? see that. Yeah. yeah. The Arabic. So we're letting in, like Canada just let in 25,000, right? So um, Toronto is especially multicultural. You probably noticed that. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Toronto's oh, absolutely. Like, probably as multicultural as New York, even. And yeah. like, because Canada, like, we're so, we've got so few people, right, in our country. We have the entire population of California in our entire country. Like, we're only 35 million. Yeah. And you guys are 350, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. It worth 35 million. So we, of course, Toronto is like, we have space. Bring, bring them in, bring them in, bring them in. You guys did, um, <laughs> you guys did past favorite episode, we premiered it for the first time, if I'm not mistaken. Two years later, they did the abortion episode. Yeah, yeah. it was something crazy. Yeah. What made you guys uh, change it again? Is it storyline based, I'm guessing? <coughs> green screen there and then this is New York it, it, so you can see it's kind of like a New York type background okay. and uh, we can put plates in in post-production for Manhattan so that you feel like you're in Manhattan and sense. you'd never notice a difference all the Paris stuff this was the French school that they went to okay and then this was a Parisian cafe and then we had plates of Eiffel Tower in Paris put in the background in on the green screen no, that's... so it looked like we were in Paris but we were just really in a makes sense. random part of Toronto yeah just a random uh... A little bit of Toronto. Yeah. And then it's important like, that we don't go on location downtown Toronto, because uh, leaving here costs a lot of money. So um, we um, even do downtown Toronto on these walls. That makes sense. Yeah. And then the only other thing is that we're being behind here is where we shoot all of our camping scenes. Okay, that makes sense. That... So that's where Adam had the party with the abandoned church. Okay. It was there. And uh, it's 
gorgeous time of year down there now. Oh, yeah. it's beautiful. Oh, so you guys just shoot all the camping scenes out there? Yeah. We never have to go very far. Yeah, they're really useful. <laughs> yeah, they're really useful. Oh, these are really, really cool. Things that we don't actually know, but they're probably true. I'm just making it standard. It's her grandmother. Okay, I like that. I want writing credit. That's an, that's, <laughs> that's an executive decision. Oh, I really, really appreciate it. So this is the teacher's parking lot? Yeah. <laughs> kind of thing. Yeah, it doubles as that. That's where Drake used to play basketball. Even just watch some uh, Drake episodes, you'll find it funny to see him in that in that like way, you know, right. in a wheelchair. It's, uh, they harness them, but they get them up there. <laughs> yeah. Tie them in. Yeah. That's funny. All times. All times. Yeah, because they're stuck in there. There's all the all the former cats that are dead, they're all locked in there. That actually oh. makes sense. That makes sense, actually. Can you imagine? Let's just see. I'm going to see if the JT York Memorial is here. That'd be really cool. Yeah. Yeah, no, I was actually wondering why you guys uh, hadn't used it. Yeah, I think you know what it was with this space thing. Because when you're shooting, um, no one will ever like you replace know, it after you've done that thing. Or, yeah. No one will know that that was the DVR. Yeah. Yeah, we used this. This has been like a hospital corridor. No, I actually did not realize that you guys did LA. Yeah, the LA complex was totally all. I did. Or, well, I'd say 90% here, 10% we shot in LA. Toronto's very easy to turn into LA, believe it or not. Because all you need, uh, we're right on Lake Ontario. Yep. Right. <clears throat> so all you need is a horizon. And outside of Toronto, we have a place called Oakville, which is kind of like Malibu, where okay. a lot of big houses are, and they're right on the Great Lake. So in the summer, with the perfect weather, you plop down a couple palm trees, and you're in LA. <laughs> and then downtown Toronto, you can shoot, or even parts of Toronto that are more suburban, like with like nice ferries, you plop down forty thousand dollars for the palm palm trees, and you're good. good to go. New York is harder, even though we look more like New York, because of the high volume of people and traffic. Oh, and right. Things. Making our Anthony is uh, is very difficult to do. So yeah, <coughs> figure right that it would be easier to do LA. Two thousand off, ninety one to two thousand one. So ten years they took off the nineties basically. And then um, it was in repeats in the nineties. Good Canadian girl. Yeah, no, that was. And awesome. we had we had Billy Ray Cyrus with Drake. How 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 much were people sweating when they shot that scene? On top of the bus. Yeah. Oh my God, that was. I insane. feel like everyone's like don't. Yeah. It costs too much. Yeah, it does. But you guys have always done everything. I mean, going, going with the whole transgender storyline that you guys yeah. have done. And you guys have tried to touch on everything. And that's, that's one thing I have always liked. And you guys have always, in my opinion, been on the right side of the discussion as well. I feel like we try to be as responsible yeah. as possible. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, that's the that's, thing. That's cool to hear that. Yeah. And you know, if, if we do show something, we'll try and show it three different ways. Like yeah. kind of like the abortion thing, like, you know, yeah, was was... three different, or even let's just say the pregnancy thing, like one of them kept it, one of them gave it away, yeah. one of them had the abortion, yeah, so it's kind of like... Touched on it. Oh, that was it. I hope you enjoyed your tour of the Degrassi set. I know John did. Yeah, no, it was awesome. I had a lot of fun. And he, he had a blast. He was like a little schoolgirl. See what I did there? Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to subscribe. Thumbs up the video if you liked it. Thumbs it down if you hated it. Or don't do either if you don't give a shit. Don't forget to check the description of the underneath the video for links to social media stuff. 
I really need a better outro. My outro kind of sucks.